Holy This song is amazing. I just want to hear that breakdown piece again. <laughs> Hello everyone, welcome back to CF Entertainment. My name is Casper Fox. I am all these cool titles that Adam is giving me right here on the side of the screen. Welcome back to Heathers. Um, today we are checking out Yo Girl and Meant to Be Yours, both animatics by Missy Asylum. I will be pausing and talking about the music, so please, if you want to check out the full animatics or the full songs, there will be videos linked in the description. Last time we sadly saw our dear mother Dumpstock uh, take a very permanent solution to a temporary problem sadly uh, which happens a lot of people that happens to a lot of people apologies for my English so if you're struggling please reach out um, I'm very happy I was very happy that YouTube actually put like a suicide hotline thing under my uh, my video very very happy about that because if people are kind of relating to the problems that Heathers have I promise you there is hope there is great things ahead of you don't give in so if you need help or anything like that, please call the number. I really hope that the number is under this video as well. If not, then, uh, you know, just literally just Google and it will be there. Because I, I don't think I'll be able to put like every single number in the description. So I trust that you guys will be able to Google it if you need it. Anyway, we're going to check out a couple of in-between scenes as well. Uh, as always, I want to thank Kiru for making the in-between scenes, Jake for advising, and for Volren for picking animatics and whatnot. These have been kind of like core reasons why I'm able to do headers and get the context needed. So I really, really, really thoroughly appreciate that. Um, other than that, I don't think I want to yap too much. I think we just get right into this in-between scene that then leads into Yo Girl. So uh, yeah, let's do it. <laughs> Aww. What is that? Okay. Wait, what? Oh my gosh. Remember that um, Chandler said that in Candy Store. I remember that rare Casper W wasn't a goldfish. Okay. So she didn't die. Also, f***ing Heather Duke, you massive Contasaurus Rex. <laughs> Bro, she's up there with Calypso. Nah, Calypso can't help it. That's a different discussion. But yeah, that's crazy. Why is Heather Duke like this, man? Okay, so now we're going to get straight into... Yo girl, and here we have Missy Asylum. Welcome back, girl. Um, yeah, we're gonna get into the Yo Girl Automatic by Missy Asylum. The original is linked in the description if you want to watch it for yourself without the pauses. Let's hear it. Martha Dump Truck took a belly flop off the old mill bridge last night, holding a suicide note. Oh my god. Is she dead? Just some broken bones. Just another geek trying to imitate the popular people and failing his Dude, listen to this really weird synth like this 8-bit computic synth here Just another geek boop, 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 boop. that's not a synth that's that might be an e-piano adam please confirm i think that's an e-piano it sounds like really like boop, 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 you know like when you were hacking in the 1980s the popular people and failing also user. interesting look at this visual because this is not this is not heather chandler but heather duke as someone you guys pointed out that she took the scrunchie from Heather Chandler kind of becoming this rite of passage that she is now the alpha Heather in a sense, right? Imitate the popular people and failing miserably. Yo, girl, keep it together. I knew you would come far. Now you're truly a Heather. Smell how gangsta you are. That sounds like JD. Girl, keep it together. I knew you would come far Now you're truly a Heather Smell how gangsta you are It's a very interesting soundscape So we have the very, very classic do 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 bass here Then we also have, it's in three fourths One, two, three, one, two, three Would be three fourths or six eighths Truly a Heather Smell how gangsta Three fourths no, it could actually be six days. You're truly a Heather. Smell how gangsta you are. 
I'm not actually sure. Adam, can you please let me know if it's 6 eighths? I think that's, this is 6 eighths. If not, then let me know. I'm not too keen on that. Anyway, listen to the soundscape here. We have this... This guitar, which normally, if you guys remember back in Candy Stores, what we have on a, like, a violin. We had a violin when, when Martha Dumstock was reading the note from Ram. And here we have it in a guitar motif instead. Very nice. Such a terrifying visual, and oh my god, JD, you, dude, I can't even, dude, uh, there's so much story-wise happening that I can't even talk about the music right now. We have this, remember I've talked about how these um, uh, half-step, um, uh, in the chord progressions, the half-steps that are happening are indica an indication of danger. Listen to how much of that is happening in the music right now. Your problems seem like life and death. Yes. And listen to the listen to the work from Gary. I want to just I want to just quickly get back to that here. Um, if you listen listen to the to the kick drum, how like weirdly placed it is in the rhythm. I think it's on two and. That's such a weird placement for the drums, but I love it. Such a chaotic soundscape we have to go with 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 like what's happening here, right? Let's jump back to where it's it happening. Copy of Moby Dick. Genius, JD. That's also just for just for for reference, guys. This word is offensive. You you can't say it like at least in my country because uh, uh, Greenland is part of Denmark. You can't call them that. It's not what they're called. Refrain from using this word if you're uh, if you're talking about Inuit people because that is an offensive term. Don't 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 use that. <laughs> Your handwriting down cold. Please, honey, talk to us. No, you wouldn't understand. Try me. I've experienced everything you're going through right now. This is such a banger visual with JD walking in his trench coat, smiling devilishly. Oh my god. Your problems seem like life and death. Guess who's climbing the stairs? I promise they're not. Guess who's picking your lock? You don't know what my world looks like. Time's up, go say your prayers. Veronica's running on, running on fumes now. Veronica's totally fine. Veronica's gotta be tripping on shrooms now. Where is that from? I feel like we've heard that. Na 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 na. Have we heard that? Is that a reprise of something? Stay there, I'll get him. Kurt, Kurt, you get my best friend. Please let me know. Knock knock. Sorry for coming in through the window. Dreadful etiquette, I know. Get out of my house. <laughs> Oh, dreadful etiquette, I know. Get out of my house! <laughs> what the f*** is this visual, Missy Asylum? I love you. Dude, this is that girl walking all over again. Sorry for coming in through the window. Sorry for coming in through the window. Dreadful etiquette. And then this, like, string, and then... Dun -dun -dun. Like, this is all just, like, one. If there was a danger motif and <laughs> Heather's trying not to mention Epic, this would be it. All of it. Holy shit. I know. Get out of my house. You should totally check out my solo. Missy Asylum, I <laughs> love you. This is great. Yeah, well, you know what? I think the next one is meant to be yours. So, you know what? We will. We will, in fact, check. Let me just see, because if that's the next one... Oh, there's an in-between scene first. Okay, so we're going to go to the in-between scene, then I'll check out your solo, JD. I promise you. That's probably my favorite visual so far. So much genius. And there's, there's like... There's a lot to talk about musically, but quite honestly, I feel like we should just continue to meant to be yours because uh, the initial message of the song was this whole danger motif, like like stress and anxiety. And I think I feel like I, I, I talked about that enough and that we have the general sound image of everything. So, uh, yeah, let's go into the next in-between scene. <laughs> All this for 
forgiven, baby. Come on out and get dressed. You're my date for the pep rally tonight. Oh my God. Why? Well, our classmates thought they were signing a petition. You gotta come out here and see what they really signed. Okay, All that was very short. Oh. Baby, come out and get dressed. You're my date to the pet. Oh, I mean, Kira, that 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 in between scene maybe wasn't necessary. I'm sorry that you had to do that. <laughs> oh well, this is meant to be yours, and this is also an animatic by Missy Asylum. Let's get into it. Rally tonight. You chucked me out like I was trash for that. You should be dead. But 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 then it hit me like a flash. What if high school went away instead? Those assholes are the key. They're keeping you away from me. They made you blind, messed up your mind. Okay, Gary, what is this rock anthem? My goodness, JD Slayin. I have a feeling, MJ, this might be your favorite song. If you guys don't know, MJ is one of my viewers. She's wonderful, very a beacon heart in our community, MJ. And she's been she's been telling me, you've not come to my favorite song yet. I feel like this might be it, MJ. Let me know if I'm right. Crash for that, you should be dead, but and listen, listen, listen to the but, 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 the, the emptiness. Everything drops in a break, but only the... But, but then it then dum 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 one two three four just on the on the on the kick drum here nice hit me like a flash what if high school went away instead those assholes are the key they're keeping you away from me they made you blind messed up your mind but i can set you free you left me and i fell apart i punched the wall and cried bam 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 then i and then we have like these power chords, like this very grungy feel that goes like dum 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 dum, you know? Very cool, very cool. You changed my heart. We also have Is that a tuba? I think that's a tuba. It's a tuba. Adam got really pissed at me for forgetting what a trombone is uh, last week, which was, you know, unlucky. But, oh no, that's two weeks ago now, because this is, yeah. I'm recording this on the 2nd of September, so the last week video, I'm recording it like a few minutes after. If you're not on Patreon, you can actually see the entire reaction to Heathers right now. It's here. Anyway, let's keep going. My heart and set loose all that true bullshit inside, and so I built a bomb. Tonight our school is Vietnam. Let's guarantee they never see their senior I live inside you forever. He's gonna bomb the school? I'm sorry, Veronica. You're gonna have to kill him. And I think that's what's gonna happen. We'll plant this note explaining why they died. We, the students of Westerberg High, will die. Our burned bodies may finally get through. To you, your society turns out slaves and blanks. No thanks. Sign the students of Westerberg High. Goodbye. JD is a criminal evil f genius but also are they really that gullible that they're all gonna like but then i mean if they're really believing that it was suicide hmm hmm okay i want to talk a little the bit about music here again we have levels from gary here very nice you, your society. And remember how I talked about the, the difference between gang vocals and harmonization here? If you don't know what I'm talking about, watch my uh, other Heather's reactions. But here again, something negative is portrayed. And the thing is that even we had in, in um, Shine Your uh, not Your Light, Shine A Light reprise, we actually had um, harmonies on something that was negative, which to me means that, that the ensemble or the onlookers actually think this is a positive thing they're singing. Here, the Westerberg uh, high school students, they know, or it seems like to me that the music is portraying that they know this is a bad thing that they're doing, uh, which is indicated by the messy uh, harmony, or the vocal-wise messy, because it gives the it gives the, the correct effect, but still, like, the messy tone we're getting to these, like, uh, shriveled and, and very, like, shuffled gang vocals here. Turns out slaves and blanks. No thanks. Sign okay. the students of Westerberg High. Goodbye. Goodbye. We'll watch the smoke pour out the doors. Bring marshmallows. We'll make s'mores. We Jesus. can smile and cuddle while the fire roars. I was meant to be yours. We were meant to be one. I can't make it Oh my 
my god, this... And look, it's Heather and Ram and Kurt, oh my god. Open the door, please, Veronica. Open the door, Veronica. Can we not fight anymore, please? Can we not fight anymore? Veronica, sure you're scared. I've been there. I can set you free. Veronica, don't make me come in there. I'm gonna count to three. Holy <laughs> This song is <laughs> amazing. I just want to hear that breakdown piece again. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Open the door, please, Veronica. Open the door, Veronica. Can we not fight anymore, please? Can we not fight anymore? Veronica, sure you're scared. I've been there. I can set you free. Veronica, don't make me come in there. I'm gonna ca- Listen to this. That is like, 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 strengthened by, like, it's empowered by the vocals in the background. This is phenomenal. Fight anymore, please. Can we not fight anymore? Veronica, sure you're scared. I've been there. I can set you free. Veronica, don't make me come in there. I'm gonna count to three. One, two, fuck it. Oh my god. No. Veronica, please don't leave me alone. You were all I could trust. I can't do this alone. you a snack. Veronica? What the f <laughs> What? I'm so confused. Did she fake her own suicide to get rid of JD? That's fucking <laughs> genius, but <laughs> what is this? And he's just sitting there. Oh god. Bro, holy sh <laughs> what the f <laughs> man? There's so many f***ers in this. I'm so sorry, Adam. You're gonna have to put a lot of skibbities here. But it's okay. Luke Holt said it's fine. This is probably, composing-wise, the best song in Heathers. So many things. So many tempo changes. So many uh, measurements with, like, different uh, approaches to the instrumentalization. Great use of choir work. Um, who is the, 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 the guy from Liv and Maddie who portrays JD here is absolutely phenomenal. I would love to know how this is played out on stage. I'd love to know. Please let me know in the comments. I'm sure the premiere chat is already telling me. That's crazy. The next video is going to be next week. And that is going to be the second to last video we record for Heathers. So, um... Yeah, if you can't wait, you can actually check Patreon right now. There's a bunch of names scrolling now that uh, have been helping me become a full-time content creator. If you want to watch the rest of Heathers, you can come on over for as little as $5 per month. Uh, we have a great community, and you support me as a content creator if you're enjoying my stuff and you're enjoying the breakdowns here that I'm uh, doing. Um, other than that, there's going to be in a teeny, teeny, weeny, tiny bit, there's going to be some boxes over here which will uh, show you some of my videos and a playlist. If you click the video or, I guess, the playlist and watch it for one minute, you'll actually tell you the YouTube algorithm that you enjoy see if entertainment and that you want to push my channel further out into the algorithm i also want to say thank you so much for the support on stories from sticks my brand new musical about hades and his highlights more updates on that very soon i don't know if the video and the concept is out by the time i'm releasing this if not mm -hmm. if it is then please go check that out as well it's probably in the channel i might link it in the premiere chat hey future casper can you do that right now <laughs> try to guess you have three choices thank you man i appreciate it welcome back to the pain and suffering what do you mean if you ever knew how hard the work on the farm is you'd feel me whatever bro anyway thank you all so very much for watching and uh thank you kiro thank you voran thank you jake and of course thank you miss asylum who are all people who are making this happen please go check out the original animatics in the description all right i hope you take care and uh yeah bye